Here in the Roseburg School District, we have a lot to celebrate. We have raised the graduation rate at Roseburg High School 16 points in the past 10 years to nearly 90%, the highest rate on record. Our district repeatedly receives the highest marks for public fund stewardship during annual audits. And Roseburg High School has one of the largest career technical vocational education programs in the state. Featuring nine pathways, such as automotive manufacturing and welding, drafting, agricultural and natural resources, and health occupations. Our students and teachers are achieving all these things in schools that are aging and in need of repair. The average age of Roseburg schools is 73 years. Where were you in 1949? Harry Truman was the president. Rudolph the Red-Nosed Reindeer was released, topping the charts. And Winston Churchill was named Time's Person of the Year. A community-based bond planning committee studied the conditions and needs of every school in the district and determined that Roseburg schools need important safety, accessibility, and security improvements. Many buildings are aging and in need of renovation and repair. Facilities at one elementary school are over 100 years old and almost all have electrical, heating, and plumbing systems that are inefficient and out of date. There is a lack of modern learning spaces, especially for CTE vocational education. The old main building at Roseburg High was built in 1926. There is no functional plumbing on the entire second floor, and it does not meet seismic or modern educational standards. Plus, the cost of remodeling would be equivalent or more than a replacement. Based on the Bond Planning Committee's recommendation, the Roseburg School District has placed a school bond on this May's 2022 ballot. Proposed Measure 10-187. What would the bond do if the measure passes? Address health, safety, and security, including air exchange and filtration systems district-wide to address classroom temperatures and air quality, emergency generators, secure entrances, elementary school playground renovation and replacements, drop-off safety projects at elementary schools, expand student opportunities, update learning spaces at all schools, expansion of hands-on and vocational learning spaces, multi-purpose facilities at five elementary schools that do not have dedicated gym space that would also serve as community event spaces and emergency shelters. Repair and update aging school buildings with priority repairs to improve energy efficiency, reduce operating costs, and preserve the community's investment in our schools. Construct a new heritage building at Roseburg High School to create a modern educational facility that includes historical architectural elements. If passed, the bond is projected to cost $1.85 per $1,000 of assessed value annually and would raise $154 million for Roseburg schools. If the measure does not pass, there would not be an assessment made. The district will receive $5.8 million in state matching funds, but only if the measure is approved. If the measure passes, funds could only be used for projects approved by voters, and bond funds cannot be used for staff salaries or PERS. An independent citizen-led bond oversight committee would monitor the use of bond funds. If the bond does not pass, the safety, health, and building projects outlined in this video would not be constructed. Want to see a detailed list of proposed bond projects or learn more? Please visit roseburgschoolbond.org. And please, remember to vote by May 17th.